Today, these 11 trading card packs will decide my new FIFA team. Now, I've built a team with trading cards before, but this time it's a little different. I found them in this box this morning outside my front door with PSG's team badge on them. And not only in the box were the cards, there was also a letter, which I haven't read yet, but let's see what it says. Mr. Pazjoch, we need your help. PSG has never won the Champions League, so use these packs to build a team that can finally win us a trophy. I don't know how desperate PSG are that they're asking me for help, but let's go build them a team. Now, each of these packs contains four different cards, and they're from all competitions in Europe, so we're going to be able to pick from the best of the best. Who do we have? We got Alfredo Morelos. Sadio Mane! That seems like a player we're going to have to add to our team. Um, I don't even know who this is. And then we have who? Vranks? No, we're definitely going with Sadio Mane. These are last year's cards, so he is still on Liverpool, but now he's on PSG. But he looks kind of lonely, so let's add our next player into this team. Ooh, Aubameyang. I don't know. He's not really in form. Who else do we have here? Scarlet. Oh, I don't know. Aubameyang might be a better choice so far. Zanoli. Who is this? Who is this? Is that Zapata? It's between Zapata and Aubameyang. I think we're going to take Zapata because he has the cooler card. Let's add him to PSG. Now, so far, we have two attackers in our team, but we need some defenders. Maybe Virgil van Dijk. First player. We got Jaden Sancho. I don't know. Do we take another attacker? We'll see. Sergio Ramos. We have a defender. I think Sergio Ramos is the player we take. Let's see the last card. Oh, it's fancy. It's Tonali. Who do we take? Do we take Ramos or do we take Tonali? You know, I think I'm going to take Ramos. He already is a PSG player, so the chemistry is going to be there, I guess. Now, I feel bad for getting rid of Tonali. He's a great midfielder we could have added into our team. Let's hope we can get one in this pack. Who's it going to be? Paul Pogba. He might be the midfielder we need to add. Who else is here? Benzema. Look at the French connection in this pack. Final player. Cameron Carter. Do we take the recent Ballon d'Or winner? We're one of the greatest midfielders. I think we got to go with Benzema. Him and Zapata are about to do some damage. I'm kind of worried we're not going to get a goalkeeper. So hopefully if one appears in this pack, we should take. I can't even open this one. I can't open it. All right. First player in the next pack. We have Gio Reyna, midfielder. He's more of an attacker winger. Let's pass on him. Kakaret, solid midfielder. And the final card. Oh! What is this? Thomas Muller. This is such a nice card. Look at that. Ageless alchemy. He does look really old, but we still love him. All right, let's add him to PSG. Wait, I just, I just picked up this card and look at the difference in thickness. What is in here? Is this the autograph? There's no way. That's a ball in there. The last autograph I got was Cole Palmer as well. This guy is following me. That is still a very, very cool card. Let's hope he has a crazy career. And he's actually going to be our captain because he is the signature card from this pack. All right, we're basically halfway through and still no keeper in our squad. How do we expect to win the Champions League without a keeper? First up, Koke. It's a midfielder. We'll consider it. Skip, literally. Mason Mount, another midfielder. This one's decent. And then we have... Ooh, that is a nice Kareem Benzema card. But he is already in our squad. So we're going to go with Mason Mount. We need a midfielder in this team. So when I was putting down the Mason Mount card, I saw the letter has a backside to it. We believe in your FIFA abilities, but if you fail to win us the trophy, you will have to cut up the card with the signature. Wait, they want me to cut up Cole Palmer if I don't win the Champions League? I won't let you down, Cole Palmer. Four packs remain before we have to play our first Champions League match. Still no keeper. Who do we have here? We got Jao Felix. No, we don't need another forward. Who is this? Who are these players? Who is this? Who is this? Aronson, another good midfielder. He's still in a Salzburg jersey here, but he does play for Leeds now. But he actually plays for PSG because he is the next player added to our team. Pack number nine being opened. Who is this? Who is this? No, I need players. I actually know. Sterling. Sterling or the final card is... Who is that? Donnarumma, we have a keeper. It says the prophecy fulfilled. This is the card we're looking at. And he was right under our nose. He already is a PSG player. And luckily for us, he is one of the best goalkeepers in the game. Two packs left. Our focus is defenders. We got Savage, which is a very good center defensive mid. Oh, I called it. We have Virgil. We're taking it for sure. Who else was in this pack? Oh my days. Why did Davies and Virgil have to be in the same pack? I'm sorry, Davies. We need to add Virgil into this team. We're down to the final pack. And if we take a look at our squad, we really need another defender to really complete this team. Let's hope we can get a defender. First up, Renan Lodi. He is a defender. He is a fullback. But we might be able to take him. Who's this? 
Doku. No, we don't need a striker. Timo Werner. No, we don't need strikers. The last card. Who is this? Who is this? Hannibal. Renan Lodi is our savior. Let's go win the Champions League. How did they get my number? Interesting choices. Round of 16 is against Bayern Munich. Our first match is against Bayern. But we do have the advantage going into this match. We have taken two great attackers from Bayern and added them into our team. We have Muller now and we have Monet. There's no excuses to lose this match. With leg one underway, our new PSG was looking like the better side. Benzema! Benzema! Near post! What a strike! This is the start we needed. This is the new PSG. But they weren't perfect. How is that not offside? Honestly, nothing close to perfect. No! What have I done? A late tackle from Ramos gave Bayern a chance to take the lead. Left. Oh, he's left. No, he went down the middle. Things were not looking good for the new PSG. But with seconds left in the match, we'd get one last chance to tie the score. 90th minute! 90th minute! Finish! Yes! In the 90th minute, we tie it up! Going into the second leg, we still have a chance. With the players rested, it was time for leg two. Win or go home. The match would start with a great run by Muller. Muller, Muller, against your past club. No, the touch. Is he okay? All right, he's good, he's good. And just before halftime, a Benzema masterclass would send Palmer through on goal. Cole, Cole, our captain. And he puts it away. What a strike from our Capitano. Our Champions League dreams are still alive. And despite their efforts, Bayern Munich would be unable to find a way back into the match. Now, it wasn't pretty, but Cole Palmer helped us defeat Bayern Munich in the round of 16. This team... As expected, quarter final are against Manchester City. Win for a small reward. Manchester City? First Bayern, now Manchester City. I swear this is the toughest road to the final I've seen. But that would only motivate new PSG even more. Can we make it 1-0? Zapata! Oh, what a goal! Duban Zapata! That may be the nicest goal I've ever scored. And the chances would keep coming. Through ball! Aronson! Sweat! Yes! 2-0 up! Zapata with his second goal. What a play from Aronson. What a ball from Benzema. A 2-0 lead going into leg two was almost guaranteed. Almost. There's no way in the 90th minute. This isn't good going into the second leg. As long as Manchester City don't win this match, we move on to the semifinals. And we get a reward if we win this match. I wonder what PSG got in store for us. The first half saw goals from Benzema and Holland, but I wasn't worried. It's fine. Manchester City still has to score a lot of goals to make it back into this game. But Zapata would get a chance to crush Man City's dreams. That's the ball. Can we finish the... Right here. That's game. Zapata has given us the insurance to defeat Manchester City in the quarterfinals. There's no coming back for them now. And there's the final whistle. We have defeated Manchester City. We're on to the set. There is a 12th pack hidden in the box. There's another pack? There was a 12th pack hidden in the box, and we can upgrade any player on our team with one from here. Ooh, Christopher and Kunku. That's a good one. We'll, we'll see. Piscina? No, no idea who that is. We got Barella. And our final card. Who is that? No. See! We got Ronaldo. This is a sign. We need to put Ronaldo into our team. So beautiful. Still on Man U. Now it hurts me to take out Zapata from the starting 11. But we need Cristiano Ronaldo, aka Mr. Champions League, to help us win this team its first ever trophy. Now our next match is against Barcelona. But it's not the Barcelona that we know today. It's kind of a past and present team because when we got rid of all the PSG players, Messi and Neymar went back to their old club. But our new signing was going to do everything to not lose to Messi. Go, Ronaldo. Far post. Yes. Hit the Sui. Oh, <laughs> he didn't look too happy that Palmer was hugging him. With Benzema making it 2-0 just moments before, Ronaldo would get a chance to score another. Ronaldo, can we make it three? Can we make it three? Far post. What a strike! 3-0! There's no way Barcelona are coming back after this. Even with Messi doing his best in leg two, a single goal wouldn't be enough to stop us from advancing to the final. We're so close to lifting that. The final is against Real Madrid. Win or else?
We have to beat Real Madrid. Remember how I said Messi and Neymar went to Barcelona after I kicked them off PSG? Well, Mbappe went to Real Madrid. This is the final match. This is where we prove PSG can actually win a Champions League trophy. But most importantly, I don't want to destroy this card. Despite a good start from Madrid, we would catch them with an early counterattack. Ronaldo, he's onside. Please, please, Mendy, get away from me. Outside, yes, what a strike. Hit the suey. Hit the suey. Su and we would keep the pressure on. Muller. Muller. Finish. Yes. His only goal so far. But it's a huge one. Right before halftime. 2-0 lead. But if you know football, there's nothing worse than a 2-0 lead against Madrid. No. Not Vinny. It's fine. It's fine. We're calm. We're calm. We're calm. I was definitely not calm. Get it out. Get it out. Get it out. No, how did that go in? They're getting the ball. They want more. How did that go in? It's 2-2 after 90. We're on to extra time. Madrid would have their chances to score. And so would we. But to no luck. It's all coming down to a penalty shootout. All right. Ramos is up first. We're going right. Please. That's the start we needed. Mbappe up first. Which way would he go? Left. Yes. We're in the lead. Ronaldo. Ronaldo. Down the middle. Down the middle. Yes, Panenka. Who's next? Modric. Modric would take a good pen to the right. Ah, too early. We went too early. All right, Benzema. Where are we going with Benzema left? Please, I can't look. Yes. Where would he go? Where would we go? Down the middle. Down the middle. Come down the middle. I knew it. I knew it. It's all up to Mane. If we score this, we win the Champions League. We're going left. We're going left, please. And we've done it! We've won PSG, their first ever Champions League. Cole Palmer is not getting destroyed. And if you enjoyed this video, you'll enjoy this video right here.